My name is uh, Mark Watts. I'm the Executive Director of C40, and I'm going to be your Master of Ceremonies for today. Uh, welcome, everybody. Um, it's a real pleasure to welcome you to New York City uh, at the opening of Climate Week and, indeed, of the United Nations General Assembly. And over the next few hours, you're going to be hearing from mayors, uh, a governor, business leaders, uh, community leaders, all of whom are united in their commitment to really turn that aspirational Paris Agreement on climate change of a few years ago into concrete action uh, on the ground, creating a, a better world as we also tackle climate change. Now, I need to start with, with the thank yous. Thank you to Johnson & Johnson, who've sponsored uh, today's event. And also, thank you to the New York Times uh, for hosting us. It is indeed the birthday of the New York Times today, 166 years old. So happy birthday, uh, New York Times. And I also need to tell you, uh, we're going to be actively promoting today's event on social media. So please use the hashtag, hashtag C40Talks on Twitter and on Facebook and Instagram posts. And we're going to be streaming uh, live throughout on, on Facebook Live. So uh, many of you will have seen um, the speculation today uh, in the media that maybe the United States is not going to pull out of the Paris Agreement after all. Who knows? Um, but here at C40, what we're really focused on is the understanding that for that Paris Agreement to be turned into a reality, global emissions have got to peak by 2020. So that's three years. Uh, and emissions per person across our cities need to come down by a little less than half by 2030. So that requires a really uh, concerted focus, uh, dynamic change, uh, really systemic change across most of our cities uh, in a very short period of time, but with a big prize that will deliver healthier cities, cleaner air, more efficient, uh, better mobility, uh, and better places for people to live. Um, and I think what we are going to hear today is uh, get a sense of the focus among mayors, the commitment to work together, to collaborate, to share, to copy ideas, and move at the pace that's really required to deliver that uh, Paris Agreement, uh, which is why we talk about this event in terms of mayors getting the job done. And there is no better person to start off today's proce proceedings, the person who really epitomizes that approach at C40, uh, than our chair, the Mayor of Paris, Anne Hidalgo. Mayor Hidalgo. <laughs> <laughs> 